For years, it seemed impossible to make real-time strategy games work for the phone. But with everyone wanting a piece of the biggest gaming platform in the world, game developers are finally finding ways to make it work. And now there's actually quite a few good and unique titles out there. So in this video, I'm going to tell you the top 10 mobile RTS games of 2024. Real-time strategy games are stressful, but like that invigorating type of stress that makes you want to keep going at it until you feel like you're finally happy with your performance. This is especially true if you're playing with other people, but even if you're just playing against a computer, you could always have made a little bit better of a decision or been a little bit faster about that. This is because strategy and speed are antithetical to each other. But as humans, we love to torture ourselves. So here are the top 10 real-time strategy games of 2024. The first game on our list is RTS Siege Up, an old-school fantasy real-time strategy game. With battles typically lasting between 10 to 20 minutes, players can dive into intense skirmishes without lengthy time commitments. The game boasts a comprehensive campaign consisting of 26 missions, along with PvP and PV modes, ensuring there's always a challenge to overcome. One of the standout features of RTS Siege Up is its medieval setting. Players will have the opportunity to build formidable warcraft such as catapults to breach enemy defenses and lay siege to opposing strongholds. Naval battles add another layer of strategic depth to the gameplay, with players able to deploy transport ships and fishing boats to control vital waterways and expand their influence across the map. Resource management and strategic positioning play a crucial role in securing victory as players must capture and protect key resources and strategic positions to outmaneuver their opponents. The second game on our list is Bad North Jotun Edition, a real-time strategy game characterized by its exquisite minimalistic graphics and elements of roguelite gameplay. The central objective of the game revolves around efficiently utilizing limited resources to fend off Viking hordes threatening the player's islands. At the core of the gameplay lies tactical combat on procedurally generated islands. As players advance through the game, they must strategically deploy their loyal troops to repel the Viking hordes. Each island presents unique challenges, demanding players to adapt their strategies on the spot and make crucial decisions to secure victory. What sets Bad North apart is its emphasis on consequence and loss. Unlike traditional strategy games, there's no room for endless armies or overwhelming force. Players must carefully manage their limited resources and units, as the loss of any of their warriors is permanent. The third game on our list is Company of Heroes. In this game, players can command two crack companies of American soldiers as they embark on an intense campaign in the European theater of operation, starting with the iconic D-Day invasion of Normandy. One of the game's standout features is its destructible environments, which allow players to shape the battlefield to their advantage. Whether it's demolishing enemy cover or creating new pathways for advancement, the ability to exploit the terrain adds a new layer of strategy to the gameplay experience. The fourth game on our list is Rusted Warfare, which draws inspiration from classic RTS games while incorporating modern technology to deliver an immersive gaming experience. At the heart of Rusted Warfare are its large-scale battles, with over 50 unique units available, each with numerous upgrades to customize their capabilities. The game's optimized multi-core engine enables seamless handling of battles involving thousands of units, ensuring smooth gameplay even during the most intense conflicts. Additionally, Rusted Warfare includes a sandbox editor that enables players to create their own custom battles and scenarios, which can then be shared and played in multiplayer mode. The fifth game on our list is Iron Marine 2, a tower-building real-time strategy game where players voyage across countless worlds in deep space to uncover and conquer new territories while facing numerous challenges and threats. The game features an engaging storyline that unfolds across the galaxy, offering a dynamic experience. With each mission presenting unique terrain, enemies, and conditions, players must adapt their strategies and tactics accordingly to emerge victorious. Iron Marines 2 introduces the ability to combine squads and leverage each unit's unique fighting skills, ranging from rangers and snipers to mechas and missile launchers. Additionally, players can train powerful heroes with specialized abilities to enhance their army's morale, firepower, and overall effectiveness on the battlefield. The sixth game on our list is Dungeon of the Endless Apogee. This game 
game serves as a port of a roguelike tactical strategy RPG that plunges players into the midst of an intricate narrative involving a group of prisoners stranded on an alien planet. Tasked with navigating a treacherous multi-floor dungeon, these characters must not only survive the perils of their surroundings, but also unravel the dark secrets concealed within. While the gameplay may initially appear straightforward, select characters, issue movement commands, observe autonomous combat, build modules, spend resources to level up, and repeat, the depth and complexity of this game become apparent as players delve further into the game. Advanced mechanics, character abilities, and diverse tactical approaches contribute to the game's intricate strategic landscape. The visual aspect of the game is characterized by pixel graphics that effectively capture the eerie ambience of the alien setting. The seventh game on our list is Metcom 2. The game unfolds against the backdrop of a world where multinational corporations wield unprecedented influence, rivaling even the power of government. Players assume the role of a distinguished military commander tasked with joining one of these corporations and participating in a conflict for control of the planet Tiberius, home to valuable and rare minerals. The game features stylized 3D graphics that bring the futuristic world to life, creating an immersive visual experience for players. With simple and intuitive controls, Metcom 2 ensures that players can focus on strategic decision-making and tactical maneuvering without being hindered by complex mechanics. Whether commanding forces in the heat of battle or managing resources to build new bases, players will find the gameplay experience smooth and accessible. The eighth game on our list is Mendistry. The core objective of this game revolves around safeguarding the core, and players achieve this by constructing an array of defenses, including walls, turrets, traps, and more, utilizing resources extracted from various deposits scattered across the game map. The game introduces a unique approach to resource extraction, emphasizing the mechanics of industrialization. While manual extraction is notably slow, players can leverage drills and conveyor belts to systematically construct mining plants that significantly enhance the rate of resource accumulation. This integration of industrial elements adds a layer of strategic depth to the gameplay. The ninth game on our list is Kingdom Two Crowns, which presents players with an immersive gaming experience as they embark on the task of building and expanding their kingdom, starting from a modest campfire and evolving into formidable forts across multiple islands. The game's progression is punctuated by the relentless attacks from a peculiar army of monsters that assail the kingdom each night, adding a layer of challenge and urgency to the gameplay. Defense against nightly monster attacks is a key aspect of gameplay. While these attacks are generally manageable, the monsters possess the ability to gradually pilfer gold until the player loses their crown. Upon such a defeat, players are reset to the game's starting point, requiring them to rebuild their base from scratch. However, the loss is not absolute, as previously established buildings on colonized islands remain intact. The tenth game on our list is 2112 TD. It stands out in the genre by paying homage to 90s real-time strategy games, particularly classics like StarCraft and Command and Conquer. The game adopts an isometric perspective and introduces a higher level of involvement in unit management, reminiscent of the strategic depth found in traditional RTS titles. Set in outer space, specifically within your base, the primary objective in 2112 TD is straightforward. Repel all enemies and safeguard Earth's colonies from complete annihilation. One notable aspect of 2112 TD is its emphasis on base management and expansion. As players progress through the game, they have the opportunity to unlock various research features that contribute to the development and enhancement of their base. This strategic layer adds depth to the gameplay, providing players with the tools needed to tackle evolving challenges and enemy threats. Well, that's it guys, hope that helps. If a game is not on here that you think should be on here, it is probably because I put it in a different genre, like perhaps a MOBA game or an action game or something else. I have a video on every genre out there, so I recommend checking out this playlist if you're interested in that. All right guys, I'll see you next time.